Hello friends, this is Nikhil Kulkarni. I am from Lalita Foreign Language Classes and today I am going to teach you German. The German language, yes, German language. So let's start. German, in German, is called, the language German is called Deutsch. What is it called? Deutsch. And from the name Deutsch, from the language name Deutsch, we have this name of the country as Deutschland. Deutschland, German, correct. So today we start with our first session. Let us not waste time. Let's start with the language teaching, language learning. We are going to learn today greetings. Now, we say German, I am just writing this name with Deutsch. Deutsch. So, today we are going to learn greetings in the German language. First greeting, very important greeting. We all know this greeting in English. We say, How are you? Everybody we meet for the first time, we meet for a long, after a long time, we say we, how are you in English? So in German, same version has two ways. One is formal, to somebody who you respect, you meet him for the first time. And second, who is your friend, who is informal. So two ways of saying, how are you? So let's start. Greetings, how are you? Greetings, how are you? In English, in German, we said. We get as inan formally. It is formally. We get as inan now informally. We get as dear. We get as dear. Now, the answer to this question. The answer to this question, usually we say, Danke, good. Danke, good. Next, we have. What is your name? He asks each other our names. Everybody is known by his name. His name is very important to him. So we say, what is your name? Formally, we say, wie heißen Sie? Wie heißen Sie? Informally, we say, wie heißt du? Wie heißt du? The answer to that will be your name. We say, ich heise, your name. My name is Nikhil. I will say, ich heise Nikhil. Or, oder, or, oder, my name is Nikhil. Okay, we have learned two greetings so far. Let's move on. We have the third question, third greeting. We say, where are you from? To understand which country you are from. You are, to, you are going to Germany, you are, going to, you, are being, you, are, you are in Germany and somebody wants to know which country you are from. It's a very important question. You need to ask it this way. Formally, woher kommen Sie? Woher kommen Sie? Formally is Woher kommen Sie? Then we have informally Woher kommst du? Informally Woher kommst du? Okay. Now we have the fourth grading. We say we understand. We have to understand which city we live in, in Germany or in India. Wherever you are living in German, in Deutsch, just Prakha, we ask this question. Okay. Formally Wo wohnen Sie? Wo wohnen Sie? Informally. Wo wohnst du? Wo wohnst du? Answer to that will be, the city name will be, Ich wohne, I stay in Mumbai, so I will say, Ich wohne in Mumbai. Ich wohne in Mumbai. That was the fourth question. Next question is, we want to know our age. We want to know our each other's age. We want to tell, ask somebody his age, we will answer with the number of age is. What, how old is he is? So we say formally, how old are you? Formally, we art zin zi. So say, we art zin zi. Informally now, we art pistu. Correct. We art pistu. Now I will tell you my age. I do not know your ages. Also, many students are seeing this video. I will encourage you, to, encourage you all to see this video again and again. So I'll say my age. Ich bin 41 Jahre alt. I am 41 years old. This video is basically made for beginners. So that's it. So next question. Greetings. Next question. Question is Ich bin 41 Jahre alt. Ich bin 41 Jahre alt. 41 is predicted means 41. I am 41 years old. What are you by profession? Was sind Sie von Beruf? Formally, was sind Sie 
Phone me roof. Informally, usually we don't ask each other's profession informally. In spite of that, I will explain. Was bis to do phone me roof. Was bis to phone me roof. I will say I am a teacher, so I will say ich bin Lehrer. Ich bin Lehrer. Okay. Next question. Which languages do you speak? People in front of you will like to know which language, which language is your expert in, or which are like not so good, not so, not so like that. So we ask two two types of questions: formal and informal. Okay. This is the first question. Which languages do you speak? Welche Sprachen sprechen Sie? So formal way. Welche Sprachen sprechen Sie? Informally. Welche Sprachen sprichst du? Informally again. Welche Sprachen sprichst du? I will give you my version. You will create your own version when you join the class or you are with me as a student. You say, my mother tongue, my mother tongue is Marathi. My mother tongue is Marathi. Ich spreche auch English, Hindi, Deutsch, Russisch, and uh, ich liebe Sprachen zu lernen. Now next is, what are your hobbies? Question is, what are your hobbies? We say formally, last question. We have the last question for the greetings part and for the parts we need for introduction purpose as per the internet. So we say what are your hobbies? The question in English is what are your hobbies? In German, in Deutsch, this is our Deutsch, we say was sind ihre hobbies? Formally, that is formally, okay? Was sind ihre hobbies? Informally. Was sind deine hobbies? Informally. Was sind deine hobbies? Now the answer to this question, the last part, last question, last greeting. Meine Hobbys sind Sprachen lernen, Flöte spielen und lesen. Meine Hobbys sind Sprachen lernen, Flöte spielen und lesen. Ja, yeah, we are fertig, we are fertig. We are, we are ready with the greeting questions and answers. We will discuss henceforth the introduction part. It comes in two minutes time. In just a break time. Okay? Let us do the introduction now. Now we introduce ourselves. This introduction is the exact the way we introduce yourself, ourselves in the Stat Deutsch even exam, which happens at Max Miller level, Mumbai, Pune, Bangalore, Delhi, all that. So let's start. Lablos gets. He say, "Hello, guten Tag. Hello, guten Tag. My name is Nikhil. Or ich heiße Nikhil. Ich komme aus Indien. Ich wohne in Mumbai." Ich bin 41 Jahre alt. Ich bin Lehrer von Beruf. Meine Muttersprache ist Marathi. Ich spreche auch Englisch, Hindi, Russisch, Deutsch. Meine Hobbys sind Sprachen lernen, Freude spielen und lesen. Es ist einfach, sich vorstellen. Understood? See you. Thank you, Herr Masimposov. Thank you, Kunal. And thank you, Saru. Vielen Dank.